hitting it hard doesn't mean just dumping money. Mm -hmm. It still needs to be a proper scaled business, not just here it is, we're dumping it in. And that is what I think a lot of companies do. But they need to know what works for them and their product. thing is this is it really depends on who the company you know what the company's got how much money they've got and what they're actually selling Mm -hmm. the the, this is why you know a lot of people give advice to brands and they say you know just either come in big you've got to have lots of money you know hit it hard and that does work for some companies but for other companies they just don't have that and then i mean i particularly like that sort of very slow sort of just seeping into the market and then you sort of turn around and it's everywhere um i've always liked that because then you're not you know especially with competition you're not really sort of getting the the word out there and people are sort of when they realize the brand is all around them, it's already sort of too late. They've already made their mark, so mm-hmm. other companies can't do it. But that but that tactic doesn't work for a big company. You know, sometimes they just don't have the time to do yeah. that. And so, you know, that it again, you know, if if, if a company's got a, a good budget um and that they want to hit it hard, they can do it, but they still need to go. Okay, hitting it hard doesn't mean just dumping money. Mm -hmm. It still needs to be, you know, it still needs to be a proper scale business, not just here it is, we're dumping it in, you know, cross our fingers and wish for the best. And that is what I think a lot of companies do. They go, you know what, if we just get 1%, and it's like, oh, no, if I hear that again, you know, the amount of times that we've heard that is just like, oh, so, um, you know, and that's why we, we've seen some amazing things, you know, Bellamy's, we've seen A2 Mill, um, a lot of the baby and mum products have mm-hmm. really done a great job, especially for Australian products, have done an amazing job. And then supplements, you see Swiss. Um, and then you also see smaller companies like Vita Glow, um, mm-hmm. that have done very well and they've been very strategic in how they do it. So both Types of companies can work, but they need to know what works for them and their product. And that's why I say is the strategy needs to be localized.